The majority of the soil we farm is actually used to feed the animals we eat rather than us. The UK is a net importer of soil and what that means is there is a corresponding reaction or action happening, increasing amounts of the Amazon being cut down to grow more soil. What we're seeing there is the repercussion is we're losing biodiversity and our forests at the global scale, which also contributes to global warming, which we need to address as humans right now. Insect farming has been going on for the past 20-25 years. It's developing as an industry. The main feature of insect farming is that you take insects, such as the black soldier fly and their larvae, and you can grow them to make an alternative and sustainable source of protein. Insect protein is at least 150 times more space efficient per soil, so you will get much more out of your one meter squared uh, in terms of protein output. A black soldier fly is a non-pest and it doesn't transmit any diseases, it doesn't actually have a mouth. And what the black soldier fly does is lay lots of eggs. It can actually lay up to a thousand eggs per fly. Now if you took one gram of eggs, you'll get around four kilos of larvae. The larvae are very voracious. They will eat a range of substrates in a short amount of time and turn it into effectively protein and fats which can be used as an ingredient in animal feed. That means you can actually reduce the amounts of other traditional protein sources used in animal feed. With a sustainable innovation fund, we're able to focus on distributing breeds of black soldier fly. And what it effectively enabled us to do was plant the seeds for what we call multiplication. Now, multiplication in the genetics industry is about taking a small amount of genetics and scaling it up or multiplying it up so that you can then supply the market. Innovate UK has done a lot for the insect farming industry. The Transforming Food Production Project is a great case in point. And the UK has massive potential to, to be a leader in the insect farming sector. And there's just a few key actions which need to be taken from a governmental perspective to create the right legal frameworks for the industry to flourish. At Beta Bugs, we make better insects so that we can sustainably feed a world's growing population.